R to R. <laughs> that's the beginning oh. of the recording. <laughs> That's perfect because that's the best way that I could be on the fan. introduced. Yes, <laughs> we're watching Lord of the Rings, the Fellowship Yay. of the Ring, yeah, the Two Lord Towers, of the Rings. Bum, 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 bum. and Return of the King. They call it a trilogy. Alfred, you're wrong. That theme was on point, wasn't it? That's the one. I love Mordor. The oh uh, by Howard Williams or whatever, the guy with the orchestra, I think. Yeah. Just, just Howard, to be clear, this is sure. the Williams. plural Lord of the Rings, I mean, not I, Lord of the Rings. That's as great as intro as you need to say that we're going to watch one of the greatest trilogies of all time, if not the greatest trilogy of all time. The greatest. I mean, it's it is kind of hard greatest, to beat, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And we'd like for you to join us, I suppose, or at least watch this video while we commentate on what's so great and so terrible. That part will be pretty quick, I'd imagine. Yeah. You guys ready? Yep. I am ready. ready to All begin. Right. Three, two, one, go. Much that once was is lost, for none now live who remember it. I opened up my file in like the, the media player and not VLC, so I can't add subtitles. Oh, you should just listen to the movie then. No, because fix that problem on your own so, time. Yeah. What the hell? To, I, Everyone shut up for the next three hours and 20 minutes, and this is going to be perfect. <laughs> it, it will make it easier for me to pay attention. It began with the forging of the Great Rings. Oh, it's man. nice to hear the real Galadriel. Yeah. It'll be cool when they yeah. make um, a TV show going over all the construction of these rings. It's going to be great. The greatest of Elven Smiths did not know what an alloy was. Did you know that you can mix metals together? What? What? What is alloys? this devil ray? And nine. Nine rings were gifted to the race of men. Which is your favorite <laughs> nine mortal men doomed to die? Mine is four. Um, I think six has got a lot going on. I don't know. I like nine because you can say it like it's nine. Nine! Sauron. The enemy of the free peoples of Middle Earth was defeated. One thing that I like is that while notice, his, <laughs> notice how his finger gets flaccid. Notice how you should shut the fuck up. <laughs> A little late for trimming the verge, don't you think? Well, Never too late to trim the verge, ladies. What if you like a bit of the verge? A little bit of verge is all right. Don't mean anything unnatural. No, I've thought of a better use for you. Makes you wonder it's if funny, there were right? several is... hobbits out there, would Gandalf just be like, you're all going to? <laughs> yeah, you're all going to. The town Man, drunk is there, he's like, yup, you. <laughs> Come along, Samwise, keep up. The enemy has many spies in his service. Birds, beasts, never put it on. For the agents of the Dark Lord will be drawn to its power. Never put it on, unless you want to go invisible. It's pretty neat. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> anyway, bye. Hey, we get like I'll see you in Mordor. Uh, the edit where after this, every time Sam takes a step, he this says, is the first. <laughs> <laughs> "Yeah, in the videos, like seventeen hours long." Yeah, it's like it's it's been, it's been six months, Sam. Can you stop? <laughs> I get it, Sam. Jesus. If I take one more step, it'll be the farthest away from home I've ever been. If I take one more step. Look at him already. Oh. oh. <laughs> My old friend, Saruman. And again, just the, st the story of how he wanted to be Gandalf, even had the blessing to be Gandalf, but man. You are sure of this? Beyond any doubt. So the ring of power has been fun. You're like the best Saruman possible. Yeah. I like that he explicitly went up to Ian McKellen and told him that Tolkien told him that he could be Gandalf. <laughs> it's like, Mom said that I could play. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Love of a halfling's leaf has clearly slowed your mind. But we still have time. Ian McKellen's like, yes, but you're so good at playing evil bastards. <laughs> Join with Sauron. Tell me. Friend, when did Saruman the Wise abandon reason for madness? See, this is where you want Gandalf to be like, Oh, you're a little cuck. You cucked out. Look at you. <laughs> <Cuck>. <laughs> oh, Saruman the cuck. Damn. <laughs> That's cheating. <laughs> Bin, baby. <laughs> <laughs> this bit did kind of make me laugh. Oh. We're still in the Shire. What could possibly happen? So, so much deliberate choices in the action and dialogue for introducing a character. Well, and the music as well. Well, really, basically all the filmmaking. A lot of the assumptions when people ask like favorite characters, the first thing that comes to mind might be a Gandalf and Aragorn, or Frodo, just the main character, maybe. But it's just like Merry and Pippin might be thought of as like, oh yeah, they're more comic relief. It's like the fucking stories those two have. 
It's like the real world. The further east you go, the less people know about hobbits. Thought that was funny, didn't you? He's one of them rangers. The dangerous folk they are one in the wild. Around here, he's known as Strider. I saw a really funny Photoshop where Pippin's over at the bar, and he's like, yeah, that's Frodo, and all the people around him are the Nazgul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you need that conversation. It's like, where, where, what are you looking for? And it's like, hobbits. Oh, he's like, all right, yeah, no, no problem. Baggins? Sure I know a Baggins. He's over there. Frodo Baggins. You fucking idiot. Over there, Frodo Baggins. Frodo! He's got this very interesting gold ring that he carries with him everywhere. <laughs> All the time. Steady on, Frodo. He says it talks to him, and it turns him invisible. You gotta wonder how many of them are wondering, like, is that a hobbit thing? They can just go invisible? Do they just go and yeah, it's, is that just a power that they have? No wonder we've never, we don't know what they are. I see you. I see you. Oh, look at it. In the void. You know, Sauron, you don't come across as very no chill and happy. He needs to read, like, how to win friends and influence people. <laughs> yeah. no to... <laughs> what do you want? A little more caution from you. That is no trinket you carry. I carry nothing. Develop his He's talking to, like, skill. a therapist about it. He's like, I present myself as a huge fire right, agga bowl. I, I'm just is imagining him, like, as the big flaming bowl sitting on a chair, you know, <laughs> sitting, laying down on the psychologist's couch, <laughs> which is a regular guy. Are you frightened? Yes. Not nearly frightened enough. I know what hunts you. You know, they have the back and forth for a while. The therapist's like, you choose to look like this? And he's like, is something wrong with how I look? <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm just told I look lovely. Right? 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 perfectly fine. I'm considered oh, handsome in my culture. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay, Maybe the mud is so soft that he's perfectly fine. Fine, yeah. We need a stinger of him, like, crawling out from under the door. <laughs> or, like, he just punch, punches through the door. <laughs> Bloody yeah. Nazgul every time. <laughs> you just hear a knocking from the other side and a muffled. <laughs> oh, that... They're so mad. They're molding. They're molting. They're molting. Now the just imagining <laughs> Nazgul getting on the ground and doing the worm like X2C. <laughs> <laughs> Though I will say, if we I were so Aragorn and the rest, I'd be like, do we need to get the fuck out of here right now? <laughs> like, are they coming? We feel the presence of the ring drawn to the power of the one. They will never stop hunting you. Where is he leading us? Rivendell, Master Ganji. The house of Elrond. Well, there was a show and tell in my school and a friend of mine in year four. He was just going to do show and tell Lord of the Rings. Simple as that. And be like, Lord of the Rings is great. I love Lord of the Rings. Now let's watch some Lord of the Rings as part of my presentation. <laughs> <laughs> be like, great. And it was Abbott Head is what he, he showed. And when it got to the Lurtz fight, uh, one of the girls started crying and we had to turn it off. And I hated her. Did a beat her Weak. up after school. What about second breakfast? I think he knows about second breakfast, Pitbull. It's so funny because, like, I think it would be consistent statistically that guys just fucking love watching, like, a warrior destroy the fuck out of a demon. Well, a lot of he girls would be like, up. ah, the spooky like demon. What about Elevensies? Luncheon, afternoon tea, dinner, supper. He knows about them, doesn't he? I wouldn't count on it. It never even registered me to me as scary, you know, Aragorn versus Lutz. It was just, like... No, it's just, freaking... like, that. It's like, by that point, you just want to see him destroy the shit out of that orc. Uruk-hai, you racist. They're all, like, the same to oh me. Oh, my than... God. Oh, no. These are for you. Keep them close. No one thought it conspicuous that Aragorn just had a bunch of hobbit-sized swords, like he was purposely trying to create a little army of salt. <laughs> I love when you get this glimpse of them. And I also so see this freaking. as like, give it to me and this will be chill, okay? And then he's like, no. And he's like, all right, fuck you then. Also, this always confused me. How did he get lost, the Nazgul? He was looking around like, what's going on? <laughs> it's like, it's just Maybe you and like, Aragorn, guys, man. Are we, 
<laughs> like, are we leaving? Are we not? It, are, are we staying? And you know that, that, that like, um, the yeah. torch is still sticking out that of went, his face. That <laughs> went through one of the skull eye holes. It stuck right in. He's <laughs> like, oh, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. I like how that moth was just minding its own business and now he's being sent on a rescue mission. <laughs> You're going to save Middle Earth, little guy. Little yeah, he's like, he's like, fly. help me you, out. Get you, the you eagles. Need to travel, you need me to travel how far? <laughs> I don't, I don't think I'm equipped for this. Well, he just I'm explains the whole plan to him, and the boss just goes, no. Are there any lamps where I'm going? Uh, boy, I do love lamps. I love lamp. Do you really love lamp, or are you just saying you love lamp? <laughs> I actually no, watched that recently. Love fucking love that movie. It's so good. Are they making the crusty burger rib witch? In what? Mordor? I don't think so. Oh, but I, 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 <laughs> you got like Tastes like liberty. We start with authentic letter grated meat and process the hell out of it. Mm, I don't mind the taste. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the, the clean answer is no, Friggy, they are not, but yeah. <laughs> this is the Krusty Burger Ribwick. All right, calm down. If he kills that guy, Sarah's gonna be like, that's your breakfast now, by the way. We're not wasting a single thing here. That was yep. your dad. That was your father. <laughs> you killed him. I will call you Rupert. It's great. Like, <laughs> these things have literally just been born, and they, like, shove them into armor and give them swords. Dude, they're, did, well, they're born like, like where's a war? Give me a like... war right now. Let's go. <laughs> is he going to die? He's passing into the shadow world. I mean, that is not the kind of thing you want to hear when you say, is he going to die? The response, he's heading to the no, shadow no, no. world. He's, like, he's, oh, he's God. Into... Are you the is lamp the great moth spoke of? <laughs> the great moth? She's like, yeah, 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 I'm friends with the great moth, yeah. He's just like, if you, I'll take anything at this point. I don't know what's happening. Are you, are you fucking real or am I just like, oh my, oh my god. I'm in the shadow world. He mentioned the shadow world. Is this world. the shadow world? This scene Jacob is important, Master. by the way, because if you're one of these Nazgul, you very likely were recently set on fire, so that's annoying, and you're about to be drowned. Yeah. The little shit that got Kevin on fire. <laughs> Kevin's in the back know. like, I st it still hurts, guys. <laughs> He's wearing one of their spare funny. cloaks, and it's like white. <laughs> like one of the Nazgul is just like smoking, yeah, there's a smoke trail behind him. <laughs> like, they, like there's still steam coming out of his face. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I'm here. And you're lucky to be here, too. Oh, new location already looks so distinct and awesome. Look at it. Oh, the candle's so lit. <laughs> it's not necessary, Gandalf. Oh, it's, it's, it's moody. What happened, Gandalf? Why didn't you meet us? Oh, I'm sorry, Frodo. It is serene, isn't it? <laughs> like, oh, you you want to wake up here. This is good yeah. stuff. It really is such a sharp contrast between all of the locations. And, you know, this is... <laughs> We're only like a very short way into the total adventure, and there's still plenty more variety. Yeah, left. we're not even oh, a not sixth of the way through this, the, the, the oh. whole story. The main plot hasn't technically happened yet. Friendship of Sodom is not lightly thrown aside. You just said a friendship with Sauron is not lightly thrown like aside. It. He's like, we are still friends, right? Like, I know you don't want to fight with Sauron and everything, but we're friends. Embrace the power of the ring, or embrace your own destruction. <laughs> You unfollowed me on me. Twitter, Gandalf. Why? There is only one Lord of the Ring, and he does not share power. Oh, such a good line. Mm. What you want when you got a one-liner to a villain is something you know is going to sit in the back of their head. Exactly. Something that they're going to stew on. Sauron would never betray me. I'm really cool. <laughs> so you have chosen death. And then you just need that moment of Sauron being like, don't listen to that Gandalf guy. You can trust me. Yeah. Part of it, right, is that the quest, there's an assumption that, like, we've done it. We've reached the end. Yep. I was like, duh. Well, that was a really great hour and a half long movie. <laughs> Oldman. Plot really hole. Plot player. hole. He did not look like that earlier. Plot hole. He also wrote the book. It wasn't written before. Now it written is. Okay. Now it written is. <laughs> <laughs> Sounded like good. <laughs> A brain hole right there. <laughs> that age, it seems, has finally caught up with me. I'm not like you, Bilbo. My dear boy. We did what Gandalf wanted, didn't we? The ring will be safe in Rivendell. I am ready to go home. Someone probably ought to sweep those leaves. It's um, no, it's character great. building. 
for the yeah, they just cowered the building in yeah. a tent, but they did. It's metaphorical. <laughs> they just keep coming back. The Damn it. Maybe video. they do I it dirt. in the morning and they just sort of accumulate. Yeah, there was a character that wanted to join the team, but he only had an axe and a sword. So he was like, "So you have my uh, uh ah, fuck it. <laughs> I guess I won't join." <laughs> Mr. Frodo's not going anywhere without me. Maybe one of them stands up to go join, and one of his buddies is like, sit the fuck back down. Dude, I'd be tempted yeah. to join yeah, this team just because they seem like such a ragtag group. It's like, this will be fun. It is. <laughs> We're coming too. <laughs> These two are just what? being like, yeah, no, we're, we're always loved that expression. expression. That expression, yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's like, uh, what the fuck are these? He had no idea that there here. was any more than two hobbits here. <laughs> oh, no, Gandalf. Is it left or right? Left. I really for... like Frodo asking for directions. There's yeah, it's especially great. with our, you know, our kind of protagonist characters, especially nowadays, they're just so fucking good at everything. They're so yeah. incredible. And even this little scene here. This fucking shot. With this music too. <laughs> oh. The money shot. Is that a kazoo? No, I'm just humming. Oh, I got a kazoo. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd like to get a kazoo. We must hold this course west of the Misty Mountains for 40 days. If our luck holds, the gap of Rhone will still be open to us. <laughs> this is Wolf trying to oh, find a way shot. to announce his kazoo. <laughs> beautiful. He's trying to fit it in. He's been waiting. <laughs> He's this like, this is my chance. Uh, Freaking uh, clearly uh, used a kazoo. My kazoo. <laughs> uh, it sounded like a kazoo from my end, but I forgot your mic is also just I don't like wanna... that. Your That'd mic is just uh, like that. It turns east to Mordor. Good. Very good. This is where in our first yeah, this trilogy, great. myself, okay. Rags and Wolf pointed out that Merry and Pippin receive more training than Ray. Ah, <laughs> that's true. That's true. <laughs> they literally do. Oh. Oh. I don't think they'll talk back to you. <laughs> Keep trying. Uh, Dude, Legolas right now is fine. probably like, fucking hell. All this time I spent <laughs> above the snow, and then it gets me. But that really bugs him. That really upsets him being well, below. Well, first out, snow. though. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Where's Ghibli? <laughs> <laughs> Make me the jump of Rohan! I take the worst road to my city! Imagine yeah. you were just casually climbing the mountain and people, like, rose from the snow doing... <laughs> like that. Evil will be drawn to you from outside the finish. And I fear from within. Well, how thin is like it spread, a... exactly? Is it spread like butter? Over too much bread? Oh, yeah, 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 that's yeah I guess thin. so. So yeah, you, you imagine the, yeah. the TV show, the movie is bread, and there's a little, you know, you've got one, you get a nice big, what would you call the quantity of butter, like, on a spoon? What would you call it? Not like a dollop. A spoonful? What, what would you call it? A spoon oh, a butter on a, on a spoon? <laughs> on a spoon. No, on a, on a knife. Did oh. I say spoon? Yeah. Said spoon. <laughs> oh. was, which is fine if that's how you spread your... No, that is <laughs> not fine. That it's is not, not fine, fine to spread all. butter that way, Rags. I don't believe you believe that. Well, then do I trust? You must trust yourself. Trust your own strength. We're all having a good time. We're watching Lord of the Rings. He'll, he'll, he's <laughs> multicultural, Rags. He's like, yeah, you do you. That's how they do it over there. You know, it's all right. And we're watching Lord of the Rings all as well. How many powers in this world for good or for evil? Some are greater than I am. I always do enjoy watching these, assuming the Lord of the Rings of the Third Age, the games are actually canon, and that the team in that are just, they're just like an hour behind the Fellowship all the time. They're just, if you just wait here a little longer, just you'll meet them. I feel the need to mention this, but it, I don't know, it's just neat. You come across this in the Third Age, and each of the doorways, I think one of them leads to a chest, one of them is the wrong way, then the correct way is the correct way in the film. Yes, that's right. Third Age was fine. It, I like it <laughs> no, a lot. Third Age was fine. <laughs> Affected. It looks like he snapped that Urukai's neck there. Like he Makes twisted his head around. I'm fighting Urukai. I do like though the the white hand of Saruman, just as a a branding. It's good. You can make merch. Whom do you serve, Saruman? Put them down. Do not stop until they are found. I just remembered the first time that we did uh, EFAT movies on these. You do not know pain. You do not know fear. You will taste man flesh. And he talked about bring them alive and unspoiled. I think it was you, Mahler, who was like, 
do you, do you mean like you just don't rape the hobbit? <laughs> what did you say yes. like that? You, you bring them to me alive and unspoiled. Sorry, but I was like, I didn't want to be explicit, but I need it said. It's like, <laughs> I didn't, I, it's, I know you pulled us from the ground and everything, but fucking hell, oh my god. It, it, now like we're the, thinking about it, sir. Lurt's fucking grimaces, like he's like, I wasn't thinking about that. <laughs> Earlier, when you said taste man flesh, what did you mean? <laughs> as soon as they get out of eyes of God, they're like, I don't like that guy. <laughs> They get far enough away, and one of them's like, we are gonna fuck the hobbits, right? And Lurch is like, oh yeah. These cloaks help shield you from unfriendly eyes. My gift for you, Legolas, is a bow of the Galadrim. I find it interesting that she's gifted uh, Legolas a bow. Do you think he'd be like, bitch, I have the best bow that I could get. Why do you think yours is gonna be better than that? <laughs> <laughs> They put actors on canoes. What's the point? They That's did. like a thing. It's so. It's you think like, well, of course they did. Probably take that ring off now, huh? <laughs> What's funny is this structure they're near in the uh, Return of the King game. No, the Two Towers game. The level starts here, and if you go up the stairs, there's a really good XP boost at the top of it. Go grab that. Frodo carries the fate of us all. We must defend him. Stay away! Frodo! Frodo's 17th fall. I should keep a fall counter when I edit these. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck him up, Legolas. Yes. It's just, it's just awesome, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> you need someone who brings a little box of salt just in case you. Ah!